Hello! So today we are going to be making a pulled string art craft and the standard for this craft is BACR 1.2.2a Make art or design with various materials and tools to explore personal interest, questions, and curiosity. So we have different tools here. Um, we're going to be using our paintbrush and our paper and paint and our string. And we are going to figure out how to make shapes with our string. So we are going to cut your string to any length that you desire. And I already have paint on here, but I would make sure you have a good, a good amount of paint so that way you can cover the string, but leave a little bit on the end so that way you can pull the string. So with your paintbrush, you kind of guide it through the paint to make sure it gets coated. And I'm going to go through it one more time. Very good. So our motivation behind this is to really explore our curiosity. And before we can loop the string on the paper, we should fold our paper in half. And after we loop our string, it will end up printing on both sides and it's going to be symmetrical. So you can do any pattern you want. And I think they all turn out really cool. Um, I'm going to help my string out a little bit here by holding it down at a certain point. And then fold our paper back over while leaving a little bit of string at the end. And this is where you'll need something heavy. And I do this just to kind of hold the, the string in place as I pull it. Now, as I was watching videos and other people doing this, and I said the firmer you press, the more filled in your design will be. And there you go. As you can see, mine's kind of hollow. I didn't press that firmly. But this is the pattern that mine created. And every time it's different, which I think is the most exciting part of it. And it's symmetrical because it's the exact same shape um, and it's mirrored. But after it's dry and matted, this is going to be your finished project. Thanks for watching.